Do tech companies release something new when there's actually nothing new? Stay with me and today we're gonna play New or Lies. We will look through five most innovative gadgets of 2023 based on a Forbes article. We will do a light research and see if they lie. First item on our techie list is gonna be MetaQuest 3. So let's see first the comparison between MetaQuest 3 and MetaQuest 2. So we just found an article from uh, Mashable, seems like a legit website. Of course, MetaQuest 3 has better resolution, better processor, more storage, more RAM, and almost the same battery life. It's apparently more comfortable, the controllers are better, there will be more games, and the price will be like $500, which MetaQuest 3 was like $400, so it's not that much of a big difference. Basically, on what we can see here, uh, there's uh, no innovation. They just increase the specs. Compared to MetaQuest Pro, which has iris tracking thing, which that's true innovation. So now let's see a little bit like how's behaving MetaQuest 3 compared to other VR sets. HTC Vive Pro 2 is also good, but I know they need a computer, so I don't think it's comparable with what Meta did. Another website, MetaQuest 2 is the best one. Okay, I'll give them that, no problem. They are the best on the market, but between MetaQuest 2 and MetaQuest 3, it's just a spec increase. So from a light research and uh, comparing a few things, uh, I can say that this is lies. No innovation. Next, we're gonna go for Ring Always Home Drone Camera. What? It's a drone uh, that's in your house and it's patrolling your house and you have an app so you can see every single corner of your house on the app. It's from Ring, which means it's from Amazon. And uh, that uh, sounds uh, very, very intrusive. Oh. Amazon owns Ring. They own uh, iRobot Roomba. They own the Hoovers, they the robot Hoovers. They own Ring and they own Alexa, which means that you basically live with Amazon. They are with you 24 seven. And if you install a drone that can fly around your house and watch everything, that's just, it's, it's a lot. <laughs> yeah, no, it's just the surveillance for the masses. So I'm just gonna classify this as lies. That's it. Next on the list. We have the first hands-free urine analysis from home. So it's like a pebble that basically you put in your toilet bowl and every single time when you urinate on it, it tracks your enzymes and your hormones and everything that's in your urine. And like it presents it on your phone, on the app, and uh, it makes an in-depth health analysis. So you can literally track if something is wrong with you, like with more than 3,000 metabolites, urine reflects our state of health with great precision. It provides an immediate summary of body health and can help detect and monitor a wide variety of health data. Urinalysis is generally performed only once a year, while U-Scan allows regular access to these measurements in the comfort and privacy of your bathroom. Come on, this is so cool. This is innovation. I could, I can definitely classify this as new. Well, yeah, good job. Good job, you scan. The next one on our list is Life is Home Defibrillator, which is a defibrillator, you know, the one that does when uh, your heart wants to take a break. Yeah. So it's the, it's a defibrillator that works from home. That doesn't sound like something very innovative. Let's go on their website. The first life-saving defibrillator made for the home. So uh, their website looks like a scam and uh, it's not a website, it's basically a page and that's it with like one picture and two videos. Let me see the video. If I click on the video, oh, it doesn't work. Uh, okay, let's just have a look at home defibrillators to see if we can find something else. Oh, look, Defib Shop, defibrillators for home use. Okay, apparently there are like uh, a lot. So we find we found at least four other ones. So this company, LifeEase, they claim that they are the first defibrillator for home, which apparently from uh, what I could see here, they are not, which means that they are lying. Lying, they're not doing great what they are doing. 
I mean, apparently they are in more than 100,000 European homes and uh, they are not FDA approved. Well, maybe they saved some lives when their website says that they saved more than 17 lives, which is great, but they're not the first. Lies! Next is the sonic brush, okay? So, everyone knows we're supposed to spend two minutes brushing our teeth, right? Well, not anymore. The sonic brush is marketed as the world's first fully automated toothbrush, meaning you don't even have to move it around your mouth to get a perfect clean because it brushes every tooth in your mouth simultaneously. The manufacturers claim it can reduce the time we need to spend brushing our teeth from two minutes to just 30 seconds. Okay, okay, got me intrigued. Let's see what's up with them. No. This is a dropshipping website from 2018. 100%, look at it. But the product, I think I saw this product before. Yeah, I was right. Uh, the U-shaped adult toothbrush or the ultrasonic toothbrush or the ultrasonic automatic toothbrush Mayek 360. So uh, what exactly is new about this? This is from like 2018 or 19 and the website is from the same period. Uh, why is this on Forbes? These are not just lies. It offends me that this product is on Forbes. It's a drop shipping thing that costs like $30. And uh, it says here on their website, brace yourselves. The patent device has a unique patent device. Patent where? These are just... My disappointment is immeasurable and my day is ruined. Lies! Oh my God. Okay, so this was it with our five innovative products from this article from Forbes. And as you can see, it's pretty hard to claim that something is new or innovative. I mean, from five products, just one solves a problem and it's new and people will use it and it will help them. In my opinion, I know, but uh, they're not new, they're not innovative. If you want us to look at more stuff, to play some more new or lies, just review some other things, just leave a comment down below and uh, tell us your thoughts. Don't forget to smash that innovative like button, hit the subscribe button, ding dong the notification bell, and also, if you want to see our latest two videos, they're right here. Bye!